By 1939, Gandhiji had become such a towering personality that nobody was ready to contest against the candidate that was put by Gandhiji for the post of President of Indian National Congress. Whosoever Gandhiji suggested to be the President of the Congress, he was to be selected. And Gandhiji, in the Tripura session, selected a man called Patabi Sitaramaya. But Savasthanda both objected to his selection and said, I would like to become the president of the Congress. It wasn't because he was after power. But he wanted to give a proper direction to the organization. According to him, Patavi was not the right man. But Gandhiji stated no and said that whatever name I have suggested is final. Something like the modern high command culture of the Congress. Believe it or not, it was Subhash Chandra Bose who openly challenged Gandhiji stating that now I'll contest the elections. Now it was for the first time Gandhiji took a political initiative in campaigning in favor of Mr. Patabi Sitaramaya and he went on to the extent to make a statement that if Patabi Sitaramaya is defeated, it is my defeat. And Patabi Sitaramaya was defeated. And Subhash Chandra Bose was elected with thumping majority as the president of the Indian National Congress in the Tripura session. And when he was elected, Gandhi went to Subhash Chandra Bose to congratulate him and while delivering the congratulatory speech, Gandhiji addressed him as Netaji, meaning that you have now become the leader of the leaders. And from then onwards, he came to be known as the Netaji Savas Chandra Bose.